Hi, this is Derek from Jive, and today I'm just going to do a brief demo of some of the integrations that are possible within Jive. And so with Jive Cloud, integrations could not be easier now. Um, and what I mean by that is being able to actually develop the add-ons, being able to deploy them all without ever disrupting your employees or the users of the system makes it just a much more enjoyable experience. Um, and to show some of these integrations, what I'll do is I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to do a search for mobile because I want to jump to a particular area within Jive. Um, and you'll see with our search, our search always breaks out, you know, into three different buckets. So the most relevant pieces of content, documents, discussions, blogs, videos, etc. The most relevant people for this search, and then the places, the different projects and groups and areas that people are working in. And so in this case, I'm going to jump directly to mobile real-time communications. And within here, what we have are product people and engineers working together to do, to do the latest and greatest mobile to, uh, mobile design for the mobile product. Um, and you'll see that they're having discussions um, or they're using collaborative documents to work on the different new designs that they're creating. But you'll also see that information from other systems external of Jive are starting to flow directly in here. And so it's very easy to connect different systems to Jive, listen to that activity in those systems, and then bring that information directly in for you to engage in a conversation. So in this case, you have Evernote. Um, meeting notes from Evernote are coming in and other people are engaging saying, you know, great notes, let's productize this. Or connecting it to JIRA and having different activities directly from JIRA flow directly into this particular group. Um, so people are always aware of, you know, what's going on with a particular project that they're working on without ever having to jump to these different kinds of systems. Maybe they don't normally go to those systems. Not only from, not only do you have the activity streams, but you also have what are known as tiles within here and the ability to extend these out. So in this example, we have JIRA project and JIRA issues. And within there, we're pulling information directly from JIRA. We're applying it to a particular project within there. And so everybody, again, is very aware. Um, and we also have these same integrations into other systems. And an example of that is, I'll just go directly into settings to show you, is anytime you set up any particular area within Jive, I can always say, let's add a stream integration. And it's going to show you a list of what you're able to add directly to this group. So whether things from Salesforce and Chatter, Facebook fan pages, RSS, Twitter, Yammer, um, Evernote, which you saw a little bit earlier, Dropbox or Box, the list goes on and on, and the different things that you can, you can connect to to make it very easy to bring everything together and get everybody on the same page, regardless of the system that they work in. Anyway, that's just a few of the examples of what you can do from an integration standpoint. There's a whole lot more, and I'll do more videos on that later, but I hope you enjoyed. Take care. Bye-bye.